So if you've been to any grocery store anywhere in America, you've probably seen the Coinstar machine. Well, this really means a lot to me because this was part of my entrepreneurial growth. When we were down and out, we bagged up tons of change to make ends meet. So I was just gonna run it through real quick. Super easy. Put your change in. Now normally you'd get your money from the machine, but I got something better. I'm at CES 2015, and I'm at the first time ever meeting with the CEO of Outerwall, Scott D. Valerio, and he's here. Coinstar is one of your products among several others. So uh, I need uh, $9.36 from you. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Great to be here. Thanks, Mario. No, it's my pleasure to be here. That was a real story about how I actually use Coinstar. My wife and I, who launched our business together, we used that as a way to really make ends meet. So that was a product, and I'm always about products that can actually help live a better life. And that was a product that we didn't know at the time until we needed to really use it that really benefited us. Outer Wall and all our products are about value, simplicity, and convenience, and bringing the ability for consumers to monetize things mm. in places they go day in and day out. We have 65,000 kiosks across the U.S. 91% wow. of the U.S. population is within a five minute drive of our kiosk. That also gives you like this unique infrastructure throughout the country to do really cool Internet of Things type stuff like Definitely. looking at retail as it advances into the future. You guys have some visions about where you kind of see retail actually going and what that experience might be for us when we're shopping. We really do think all that connection that we have with our Redbox business, our Coinstar business, and now our Eco ATM businesses will allow us to bring products and service to our consumers using mobile apps as well as the kiosk in ways that haven't been done before. I'm excited and you're well dressed guy. I love, <laughs> love that too right there. Great. I still want my $9.36. You got it. You're not getting off the you hook without it. that. But we're going to take a little tour yeah. around your booth That's and great. check some things out. So I got my gift card. Yeah. I actually travel with this stuff, man. <laughs> and you're telling me that this is going to be able to fix my problem of getting a lot of gift cards from, say, the holidays or birthdays or any of that you stuff? You bet. You just put it in the kiosk. It'll offer you a price. You accept the price and out of voucher comes and go get your cash. Are you That's serious? Easy way to do it. Yes. So I don't have to shop anymore if I don't want to. I can no. just get the cash get if I need it. Get the cash. It. And we accept over 150 uh, gift cards. Let's move over to one of our, our newest kiosks, Eco ATM. Eco here's, here's, ATM. Okay. Here's how you can monetize your tablet mobile phone or mp3 player will pay up to four hundred dollars for those products based off of quality version and uh, addition of it and it's all done automated it'll evaluate your phone it'll tell you what it is it'll tell you uh, what condition it's in and then offer you a price and cash comes out of the kiosk so wait so wait so this is huge right because we all get a lot of technology and we're upgrading faster than yep. we have before so even if you have something that's maybe old and cracked or just old around the house that you're not using anymore you're saying you can bring it to the ATM the, the Eco ATM will actually analyze it. It has cameras yes. inside that, that look for blemishes, dents, things like that. Definitely. So you don't keep the phone until I'm, so if I put the phone in and I see the price I right. don't like, you don't I like get my phone, phone back, back, right? You bet. Just it's double checking for you guys. But it's a great kiosk, about 1,500 kiosks in 44 <laughs> states right now. All right, so they can log a line, type in their zip code and see if there's one near them? You bet. Okay. That's great. This is where we're debuting our uh, sampling kiosk here at CES. And this is a great sampling. sampling. Right. So beauty products, think about uh, ah. drug stores, uh, grocery store, mass merch, go up and you have to try a product. So you pay a dollar, get a sample that you can use for one or two days and try it out, wow. and, uh, as well as coupons. And okay. so if you like it, you can come back with your coupon and get a full uh, size version. Our CPG partners love this, our retail partners yeah, love Yeah, I bet, this. because people don't want to spend, you know, 10, 15, 20 dollars and then find out something's not really working right. out for them. So it allows them to uh, pick and choose and then uh, come back. So this is, again, debuting, debuting here at CES. Although I think people know how Listerine works. Perhaps. Perhaps. <laughs> but maybe not, right? Maybe, maybe not. not. You never know. to everyone differently. That's right. <laughs> and then we have, of course, Redbox. And Redbox is yes. uh, one that most people know about. We are the continue to be the leader in transactional new release movies. Mm. In fact, we uh, actually transactions in 2013 were greater than any of the uh, VOD transactions all combined. Okay. Uh, new release place to come, great place, value, convenience, and simplicity, and, and it's a business that uh, continues to strive. And as I mentioned before, 36 million uh, emails a week are going out uh, going to out tell customers people about that what's happening. want to know. Yeah, they've yeah, asked they want, they want the updates, what's exactly. coming new. I mean, I've used this a lot when I've traveled. You know, you go to a place and you're like, oh, I forgot the DVDs or I forgot movies or whatever. And not once has any of mine skipped or been scratched or had a problem. Great. I don't know how you guys do the quality control to maintain that. Um, but one of my questions is, how close are you to the release schedule? Half our studios were on the release date when you would get it on uh, VOD or be able to buy it in the store for half our studios were 28 days later. But the key thing there is, is it's all new release content. 
as well as the fact the great value, you know, the dollar fifty and the two dollars is, is a great value for our consumers. And what's the real value for the app? Like why would I have the, the, the Well the app is that? great. The twenty six million app downloads you can reserve online so you can take your favorite kiosk, ah. see what inventory is there, say I want that movie, <laughs> reserve it so when you come up to the kiosk you just swipe your card mm. and the movie dispenses. So you know it's there when you get there. That's key because the moment of like discovery of going and then you're like oh, I want to see this movie so bad and then you go through the machine and find out it's out. Not cool. Doesn't right. feel good. That's right. Just now you can do it night. online. So it's, yeah. it's great it's and you know it's there and it's guaranteed it's there. Oh my gosh. That was one of the best movies. <laughs> that was great. Oh, hey, hey Andy. Hey. How are you, man? Good very to see good. you. Very good. Very good. So, you know, it's funny. I was just playing around on the, on the Redbox unit here. But when I got to thinking about like all the different devices that you guys have, this massive network that you have, right, right. it kind of got me thinking like your title is president of innovation and new ventures. There's more to Outer Wall than just these physical boxes that we see, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Let's talk a little bit about where we're going now. You, we talked before about 66,000 uh, locations globally. And yeah. because of that, we've got, we've developed a pretty strong point of view about the future of retail and specifically okay. how automated retail is going to help play into that future. Like shopping in the grocery stores? Like smart so shopping experiences. Smart shopping. Like exactly. this is a place that hasn't changed really, technology really hasn't permeated this area of shopping experience it has in a big the way. The shopping, the grocery store experience has been largely the same for, for many, many years. Right. We see a huge opportunity for automated retail to help reshape that experience. And a lot of it has to do with the cell phone. In the future, the cell phone, the smartphone, will become a tool to help consumers interact with the store. Hmm. And more importantly, to help the store interact with the consumer. Because of the smartphone, the store greets you through your cell phone says, how can the store guide you and help you today? Okay. And you say, well, I would love it to. And you can enter in a plain text search for, say, a 30-minute chicken meal. Okay. Immediately what pops up is a whole set of recommended recipes for smart, uh, quick, and easy chicken meals. Now these meals are integrated with the store and the ingredients behind what it takes to get these meals cooked are, are mapped all throughout the store. Ah, so the, so the I know what aisle phone, I need to go to, where I'm going to exactly, pick things up. It so can, can help okay. you and guide you all throughout the store. What's also cool is the aisles can call out to you and recommend food and wine pairings for the meals that you're looking <laughs> for, knowing that you're right there in front of the, in front of the aisle. Okay, so boom, I put in, here's the recipe I want to see. Yeah. It'll guide me into the store of Absolutely. what's available and it'll let me know what else I could pair with that meal to make it that much more better. And then if there's any discounts for any of those products, that all happens within the app itself. I don't have to worry about that when we get to the register. Not at all, yeah, it all happens within the app. And so what's really happening is now you are a much more empowered consumer. It just hit me. Now she can send me to the store <laughs> because there's no more excuses. Oh, honey, it. I didn't. You got it. There. She'll be like, no, it's in the aisle. It's in. I. It's right there. I see it. It's yep, <laughs> yep. You're doomed. That's it. I'm done. Great. This All interview right. is over now. <laughs>